So today I want to make a video about the HP 45, uh, which was HP's third handheld electronic calculator and the second scientific calculator model. It was introduced in 1973 and discontinued in 1976. Uh, the calculator was codenamed Wizard, uh, which is the first known use of a codename for a calculator, and it built on the success of the HP 35, which was the world's first scientific pocket calculator. Uh, the 45 was HP's first calculator uh, with a shift key that gave the other keys alternate functions uh, and to which HP still holds a patent. Uh, and it included for the first time uh, the last X command, uh, numbered data registers, store and recall register uh, arithmetic, uh, built-in conversion constants, and a selection of trigonometric modes um, such as degrees, radians, and gradients. And all of these features are still used in HP's scientific calculators today. HP 45 came in an impressive solid plastic box uh, with a faux vinyl exterior. It was designed for the business users of the HP 80. Uh, it has an olive coloured felt interior with a compartment for the owner's manual, uh, the calculator itself and its power supply. So the calculator itself has an internal rechargeable battery pack, but I'll use it via its power supply today. It has a physical on-off switch um, and has a red LED display that can display 10 digits, including the decimal point. Uh, on the back is a reference panel and four uh, rubber feet to stop it slipping on the desk. And the keyboard is uh, color-coded, so there's the gold uh, shift key, uh, in black are the trigonometric functions, uh, dark grey are powers, roots and percentages, and light grey are the stack and arithmetic operations, uh, and uh, the digit keys are in ivory. So it's interesting to notice that the layout of the arithmetic operations is different from most modern day calculators, which tend to be on the right, and go in the order of divide, multiply, uh, minus and plus. And the calculator uh, keys are a little bit clicky and still pretty satisfying uh, to press. So the calculator, of course, uses reverse Polish notation or RPM. So to calculate 2 plus 3 times 4, uh, you enter the numbers on the stack and then hit multiply uh, and then plus. Uh, and uh, the 45 supports fixed or scientific notation, uh, so I can switch back to fixed now. And uh, it supports uh, power and inverse, um, log and natural log, uh, 10 and e to the x, uh, square root and, and square. Uh, and you also have your trig and inverse trig commands, and these work in degrees, radians or gradients. Uh, so you can also calculate factorials. Uh, yeah. So you can, you can also swap the X and the Y registers uh, and uh, roll down the stack. Uh, the 45 also has nine addressable memory registers, so you can store a number in one by hitting uh, store followed by the digit of the register and uh, recall it later. So if, I, if I, I can store the number five in the register one uh, and then recall it. Uh, there's also percentage and delta percentage keys, uh, and it can also convert from centimeters to inches uh, kilograms to pounds and liters to gallons. Uh, the last X key uh, recalls uh, the last uh, number that was in the X register. And there's also a pi constant uh, and you can also store a series of numbers in, with the sigma plus key and then calculate the mean and standard deviation. And all of these functions will be pretty familiar uh, for anyone who has used an HP RPN scientific calculator before. So that's the HP 45, one of the early milestones in pocket calculators. 
And at the time, for many users, it would have been replacing the slide rule as the primary means for calculation um, in, its, in its brochure of accessories. Uh, there's a quote from Leibniz, um, and it's unworthy of excellent men to lose hours like slaves in the labour of calculation. I mean, it is an indication of what a huge leap forward this device was at the time. I'll read from the introduction in the owner's handbook. Uh, the HP 45 has far more computing power than previous pocket calculators. Its accuracy uh, exceeds the precision to which most of the physical constants in the universe are known. Uh, the user guide actually begins with uh, little is understood about the methods used by calculating prodigies to perform their awesome feats um, and goes on to say, although your HP 45 uh, might not be so fun to watch, it makes calculating faster and less arduous because the operational stack and the reverse Polish notation used in the HP 45 provided the most efficient uh, way known to computer science for evaluating mathematical expressions. Uh, so yeah, I hope you've enjoyed this video and found it useful.